Hey guys, Anders is here. So in today's video, I just want to show you guys the Kingdom of Amalia on a Nintendo Switch uh, directly recorded in a dock mod. So the last time I did show you guys the uh, Kingdom of Amalia gameplay through the handheld mod. So I've decided to make this video to show you guys how the games look like in a dock mod. So as you guys can see here, um, some of you guys comment me that the games itself uh, had a blurry uh, images so as you guys can see clearly here uh, the game itself is super clear like I told you guys like I reply on some of you guys that comment on my previous video and what I can say here is the game itself had no blurry uh, graphics just like what you guys see on the Witcher 3 and some of the ports on a switch like Mortal Kombat uh, Wolfenstein so you guys might uh, if you guys play uh, one of the ports that I just told you guys earlier you guys will see the graphic is had a blurry effect and um, that because of the game itself is being ported into a Nintendo Switch so they need to downgrade the image itself so that you guys uh, will have the blurry uh, graphic so as you guys can see here uh, the Gameplay itself is really smooth, so I could say that this is 30 FPS um, stable. But uh, when you guys play it, it feels like you play it on a 60 frames per second. So I'm not sure if it was 60 frames per second or 30 frames per second. But uh, what I can tell you guys is when I play this game, it feels like uh, I played on a 60 frames per second. Alright, so we will try to make a quest here really quick. Alright, so uh, I already have completed uh, for beating the first boss uh, inside the castle here. As you guys can see, I don't know if this castle, uh, what of the name of this castle. So I already have complete beating the boss there. So this is the first level if you guys play this game and uh, there's no frame rate drop issues while i'm playing this until i survive and getting out of the castle so as you can see this is how the games look like in a dark mode all right so i'm going to level up my character here first okay so let's go ahead and play around for a while to see um how the games looks like in a dark mode oh wow he looks like the Thor on the Marvel character as you guys can see if you guys saw it clearly uh, at his faces alright so I might skip this and I don't want to make this video longer since then I just wanted to show you guys how the games uh does looks when you guys play it on a dark mod all right so we are right into the fighting here i'm oh, sorry special and defeat enemies get a threat of fat energy now how can I use the fat energy as you can see there's a sword uh, on the ground there so you guys also can loot the sword later on if I'm correct so there's still enemy I mean it's to defeat here first so reckoning mode Oh, so that is how you guys active the uh, reckoning mode. Just press the Z, L, and Z R button at the same time. Or oh, you need to hold it. Oh wow! So the reckoning mode. Uh, makes your opponent into a slow motion mode 
As you can see here. Wow, that is awesome. Right, so as you can see, there's no frame rate drop issues, and I hope that will answer some of you guys uh, were asking me how about the frame rate and how does the graphics look? How uh, is it blurry or not? Alright, so that's all for this video. I just want to show you guys this uh, the gameplay itself uh, in a dark mode, so that will. Uh, so you guys can saw it clearly uh, before you guys buy the games itself on uh, the next two days right so if you guys enjoyed this video please do leave a like to support my video here and don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel for more switch uh, um, gameplay video and i'll see you guys on the next one goodbye everyone